After almost a near 90 minute delay, these two teams hit the field and it was end to end. That's why it's hard to believe after all of that, no score here at Wake Med Soccer Park between the Carolina Railhawks and Jacksonville. Hello everybody, I'm Dean Linke along with Sam Sockley. And Sam, you get the feeling the Carolina Railhawks will rule the day that they didn't get three out of this one. Yeah, and for me it was a game of two halves. You know, I thought Carolina Railhawks were excellent in the first half, probably 12 to 15 crosses in the box, some good chances on goal. In the second half, it wasn't that they were bad, I just felt that they ran out of steam a little bit and that's probably due to the, to the cup game on Wednesday and extra time. That game they won five to nothing, no goals tonight, but plenty of chances. So let's roll to the highlights and we'll show them to you, including some from Jacksonville. Yeah, here you see Keita, you know, he was hitting balls from all, all evening from long range and you can see that one, Kira just tipped around the post. Here's a great work corner. See Menson getting part of it, Shula flicks it on and it's just a reaction save from the goalkeeper. Once again, another corner coming in. You can see bodies everywhere and it just drops to Drew Becky who just tries to fire it into the back of the net. Here, lovely work, free kick there, up and over the wall, but Akira, like he was all evening, excellent with his touches and handling and saves. Here, just reactions again. This Barrow, brilliant. Look at his footwork here. He was excellent for Armada all night. Yeah, it was hard to believe, though, at halftime that it was no score, because even Deleuze almost put one in. Yeah, you can see there, he just steadied himself here and just hits that ball, and it's hardly moving. It's just dipping at the last minute. You can see it was just an excellent game for Deleuze. He just couldn't find the back of the net. Here you see another ball over the top. Shula working really, really hard. Does everything right, cuts inside for me. I think he's just got to bend that. He doesn't need to drive that ball there. Bend it far post. Burrow involved here. Great ball across from Keita. You can see Johnson coming in and Drew Becky does a wonderful sliding save. Here, little ball around the corner. You can see Naz goes through to the goalkeeper. Johnny Orlando didn't get too much today, but he, when he did, he did this. It drops to Deleuze and he just tries to guide that into the far post and miss hits it. You can see Deleuze he got, sorry, beg your pardon, Hassan here, he's working his socks off. Look at his work right here, his little toes. At this point, everyone's just trying to get the goal. Drops it to lose again, and it's just falling back as he tries to guide that into the far post. Here, Naz spoke about it in the game. He slides, he's not trying to win the ball. I think he's just trying to slide to get the block to go into the back of the net. The work was there, the kids had a great time, but nobody saw a goal. Once again, for Sam Sockley, I'm Dean Linke, your final score from Wake Med Soccer Park, Carolina and Jacksonville at zeros.